Okay, guys, what is up? Welcome back into the channel, guys. Today, we're going to be looking at LA possibly bringing back OBJ. So, Iron Rapport has reported that the Rams are the leaders in the team that would be likely to sign receiver Odell Beckham Jr. No doubt that the talented pass catcher had a resurgence in his production when he was brought to the Rams after a slump with the Cleveland Browns last season over eight games. Last season, over eight games with Los Angeles, Beckham had 27 catches for 305 yards, five touchdowns in the Super Bowl. OBJ scored the first touchdown in the game, and with coverage favoring Cooper Cup, Beckham seemed primed for more opportunities until he went down. Due to the injury, Beckham will miss part of the next season. However, the Rams are in good shape with receivers returning the Offensive Player of the Year and having added Allen Robinson. Could still land OBJ. If, if he comes back for the second part of this year, and in the same effect he did for the next ball season, it would be a huge grab. So, uh, I think it would be huge to, um, I think it would be huge to re-get, to re-sign OBJ. You know, then we'd have Cooper Cup, OBJ, and Allen Robinson. But now let's look at Cooper Cup leading NFL receivers in yards since 2019. Um, in 2021, Los Angeles Rams top receiver Cooper Cup removed himself from the most underrated player list by steering himself as undoubtedly elite amongst his position. He got himself voted as the offensive player of the year. Became one of only three players to receive votes for the MVP in the National Football League. The other two MVP candidates were quarterbacks Tom Brady and Aaron Rodgers. However, while his household name recognition has taken hold only this year, Cup began his work as an elite receiver well before 2021. As posted by PFF, Cup has recorded the most receiving yards of all receivers in the NFL since 2019. Cooper Cup 4,082, Devontae Adams 3,924, Stephon Diggs 3,892, Travis Kelsey 3,770. Not to be overlooked is the, that fact that this run for Rams leader takes place the year after a season ending knee injury in 2018. Now Pro Bowl, All-Pro, Offensive Player of the Year, and Super Bowl MVP, Cup is 28 years old and preparing for a sixth season in 2022. <laughs> and, okay guys, now, we're going to look at Cooper Cup being the best route runner in the NFL. So, PFF posted a question, who is the best route runner in the NFL? Although they put a picture of Las Vegas Raiders' Devontae Adams, the answer to the question is none other than Los Angeles Rams' triple crane with crown leader, 2021 in receptions, yards, and touchdowns, and Super Bowl MVP, Super Cup. Complete respect to all the great current route runners is given from Adams, Justin Jefferson, and Odell Beckham Jr., the list as long as route running continues to evolve as the receivers are given more room to work and it becomes more of an even playing field of speed versus speed and quick versus quick. Cup has all the typical traits of an excellent route runner from varied starts, quick breaks, and the use of leverage. However, the one thing that puts him above <laughs> the rest is his knowledge of the game. Cup's ability to see the entire field like a quarterback allows him to see openings and opportunities that other receivers might miss no matter how quick their feet are. His knowledge of defenses give him the edge to anticipate defenders' movement, which makes him appear quicker than others. <clears throat> His attention to detail, like grinding out of sale routes instead of looking back too soon, which would slow a receiver down, Makes him great. And finally, as McVay says, Cooper Cup is a dog. When it's time to just go get it. For example, jump ball to win the championship. Call on Cup to win that route also. So, um, yeah, guys. You know, Cooper Cup is a beast. But that is going to be all for today's video, guys. And I will see you guys next time.